Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video. Today, I'm going to be cleaning. I'm not going to get distracted this time. I'm, I'm truly, this is, this is the time. I'm going to clean my base, and everybody's going to be like, Code, you did such a good job, because I have been getting distracted like crazy, and people are like, Code, you didn't clean your base. What happened? I'm like, ah, well, I tried. I was doing it. I'd started. But you know what? That's like that's part of the the point of you guys watching my videos is because they're like, oh, code is like so distracted all the time, <laughs> which is kind of a good thing, right? Um, let's see here. Let's get this out of here. Excuse me. Ooh. And let's grab a truck. And I'm going to grab gifts and fill up the truck. Oh, oh, come on, come on. Oh, no, no, I'm stuck. Oh, dang it. All right. We can just do this. So this. Here. Actually, that's that's gonna be double the work. Ugh, ugh. I don't want to do that. That is double the work, isn't it? Hold on. Is that the truck? That's not the truck. Is this the truck? Is this the truck? Here. Is that the truck? That is not the truck. Oh, it's a black truck. Nice. Oh, this was this was a. <laughs> All right, let's get these out of here. Excuse, excuse me. Can, can you come? There we go. Let's get this out of here. I love the Utility 2 vehicle, by the way. I like the sound of its engine. I think it's a Volvo. <laughs> hmm. um, anywho, spooky time is over. Halloween was great. Had a great and wonderful time. Um, we did so much. It was, it was fun. It was a lot of fun. Hmm. I have an idea. I don't know how I feel about this idea, but I'm going to try it. Code, you're getting distracted again. Well, maybe. Maybe this time. Just a little. I'll only have that wedge. Dang it. I don't have any other wedges. Hmm. Maybe I should go buy blueprints. No. Code, you're cleaning this time. Hit B. Hit escape. Hit. Okay. You know what? Escape. Don't just be. Ah. There we go. All right. Uh, here we go. Throw that in. This. Throw that in. You know, I spend more time talking about doing things than actually doing things. I've realized. I mean, I do I do a lot of stuff. Like on lumber and in Roblox in general. On Twitter. Lots of things. Oh, and by the way, today technically is the first day of No Shave November. And uh, a lot of you might be like well, Code, what is No Shave November? Well, um, normally what is done is men will grow out their beards in support of um, m men who have testicular cancer. That's where the, the term No Nut November comes from. But the reason for that is because the chemotherapy that men have to go through makes us lose all of our hair. Same, It's the same with anyone, but the... The loss of hair is caused by the fast growing cells. Your hair, your fingernails, um, all that is is a fast uh, producing cell regeneration. Um, one of the reasons chemotherapy works is because it prevents cells from growing fast. So the ones that can't reproduce or grow quickly die. So that's how this, the cancer cells die. They are a fast reproducing cell. So, um, what I do is, um, because I'm very family oriented, child family friendly, stuff like that, I don't do it for men's cancer. I do it for children's cancer. So what I do is I grow out my beard, uh, in support of, um, Mercy's, this is not Mercy's, it's uh, St. Jude. So, I will be growing out my beard all this month, the entire month of November, for St. Jude's Hospital. And at the end, I will shave my face and donate all the profits from my shave video to uh, charity, to the, their cause. So, and you can help. What you will do is you will uh, watch that video as many times as possible. I'll put three ads on it, and all the ad revenue that gets generated from that video goes to, towards a donation. And I do that every year. So, 
It's a way for you guys to help out without actually having to donate because I know a lot of kids out there are like, Code, I want to help, but I have no money. Uh, Code, I want to donate. I want to do something for you, but I, I have got nothing. Well, guess what? You do have something. You have time. And time is what's going to be needed to help out on that video. Now, I'll give you the link and stuff so you can go and make your own donations if you want to, but I don't encourage it. In fact, I, I strive against it. I'm like, don't, don't do the donation. Do the view and get the, uh, the ad revenue. Um, first off, it helps out Google ad revenue. All right, Google gets paid because they're advertising. Um, the company that paid for the ad advertisement, they're getting paid um, because they're getting their, their ads worth out there to you guys. And then I'm technically getting paid, but all that money that I generate on my channel is going to go straight to you guys, straight to, uh, to your donation for St. Jude's. And by the way, I don't know if I'm supposed to be able to do that, but you know what? It's my channel, it's my ad revenue, and that's what I'm gonna do. So any any ad revenue that comes from that video, uh, I will donate. Now, um, here's the thing. After a certain amount of time, I usually turn off the ads. That way it doesn't generate more revenue going towards that particular video if people watch it in the past. And then that way I'm not collecting from something that I said I was going to donate. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. That was scary. So. Oh, what happened, bro? Broski? Is this one not connected? What happened to you, dude? Ugh. You know what? I don't I don't care. I don't I don't know. I don't care. I got a lot of wood that's fallen off. Of course a lot of this is, is thrown. So, oh, by the way, a lot of people have been asking me to play with them in servers. The answer is still no. I am playing on private server only uh, for the time being, for probably, you know, for a long time. And I will keep, keep playing on a private server and just hanging out by myself and having fun. Which, it doesn't make for an exciting video, but at the same time, there's still a lot of stuff coming up and, and going on inside Lumber. Um, we've got Thanksgiving coming up. That's going to be the next the next big event. So stay tuned for your purple leg turkeys or whatever whatever color he decides this year. And hopefully we'll have like some cranberry sauce and stuff like that. But we will definitely have Christmas presents after that, which I'm always excited for. You guys know that's my favorite time of the year. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Wait, does that mean that the, the Christmas songs have started? Oh, I hope the Christmas songs have started. I am ready for some Christmas songs. We have a, a channel here, KBG, KGBX, something like that. It's the Christmas channel because every year about this time, my, my radio, it changes to that station and it doesn't leave until after Christmas. And even then, I'm still, I'm still singing it, you know? I'm gonna be so sick of, of Christmas songs by the time I hit 40. Oh, by the way, my birthday is coming up. You know, I forgot to forgot to kind of mention that as well. I've got um, my birthday in December, so it's like what five five, five weeks? December eighth. That's my birthday. I'm ready for it. I'm ready. I'm ready. By the way, I'll be turning 39 this year. You know, I'm only one one year away. From all of those statements that trolls and people have said in the past, why is a 40 year old man playing Roblox? N not this year and not next year, but the year after, you guys can say that. And I, I can't be like, oh, that's so offensive, because it's gonna be true. It's gonna be a 40 year old man. I used to, uh, used to get mad. And you know what? I'm not mad about it anymore. <laughs> uh, I'm like, I'm 35! <laughs> all the 12 year olds are like, that's still old. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> you know what? There is no age to gamers. All right? If you were a gamer, that doesn't determine your age. And if your age is determining what game you play, then are you really a gamer? Because a gamer wouldn't care. <sighs> and a lot of people who, uh, who put emphasis on that, they're like, well, you're 40 and you're playing Roblox. You know what? Gamer for life doesn't mean it stops at a certain age. 
and I'm going to be playing a bunch of games. Hopefully, if I have enough time tonight, I'm going to try and start back in on some Minecraft. I have a Minecraft server that I'm paying for that's been out there for almost a year now, and I haven't done anything on it in so long, you know? But I play, I play Mud, I play Fortnite, I play all kinds of different games, and I just realized, like, I've been doing nothing but lumber for so long. So long. You know? It's time, it's, ooh. It's time to start adding back in some content. It's time to start doing my thing. And, you know what? I'm thinking about recording for the weekends as well. Because I've got time. I, I do have time to go and record an episode and put it out there for you guys. So why not? Go back to seven days a week? Huh? 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 <laughs> uh, should I put pictures in here? Have I been putting pictures? Yeah, we'll put pictures in there as well. Whoa. That's, uh, that's ice. Oh, these are all turkeys, right? Yeah, those are all turkeys. I don't know what to do with these things. I'm going to eat one. Ooh, feel the speed. I've got speed run. I'm just kidding. Uh, that effect does not actually increase or do anything. What did I just throw in there? That's... Okay, there we go. Uh, and this is ice wood. Ah, oh, did you get stuck again? Alright, you know what? You're get, you're going in too. You're getting the chop block time. There we go. Ugh. I should not have pinked up my face. Now it's now it's like all oh, hard to see and stuff. I just that's telling me to keep moving. That's what it is. It's a reminder code. Don't stop moving. Don't stop moving, moving. Clean that base. You know you do it. Oh my gosh, we've got so much stuff. You know. I thought about it. If I were wanting to go on public server, I would just have to lock down all this stuff. So I could I could build over the top of it. Hold on. Conveyor belt, I can actually take out and just slap right there. There we go. That's some logic that goes over here. Should we pick, put the 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 put no, should we put the pink candy bars in here as well? Hmm. Hmm. Maybe. Let's do it. Go me. There we go. Come on. Oh, that's going to be a drive. Okay, you know what? Let's just do this. I mean, that's, that's going to be a walk. Let's put all the pink candies into the back. See, the reason I don't like doing this is because now it's going to be two trips. It's going to be me picking up these candy bars twice. You know, but if I, if I do it in a quick manner... Oh, can I do it? Like... Super quick. Whoa. Hold on. Can I go around the back? Oh ho! Oh ho! Hold on. Oh ho! Nice. Like that. I got this. Whoops! I dropped it. Wee. Uh oh! Dropped it again. Okay. There we go. It's so hard to do from. The front. It, it, oh, where'd it go? Oh, oh, I got another pile back here, don't I? Oh, wait, is it the same pile? That's the same pile. <laughs> I was a bit confused. Ugh, oh, I can't see anything. Okay, there we go. I can barely see. My vision is pink. You know what I mean. When I'm cleaning my base, yeah, you know what I mean. You know what? We can we can do all this stuff. Oh. There we go. And then just grab it just short little distance over here. Actually, here, let's do this. Let's back it back it in. Uh oh, what I hit. Oh dang it. Okay. Maybe we'll go that. Maybe we'll go this way. Come on, turn, 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 buddy, turn. That's good enough. Okay. Oh, Okay, th this pink is just not working for me. Let's reset. 
Reset. Reset. Oh my goodness. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Boom. All right. And we can, you know what? I'll, I'll go ahead and pick these up as well. And then change, switch. Thank you. Oh, what are you, what are you doing? Good. There we go. <sighs> there we go. Good. 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 Almost done. So, I know that a lot of people during this time of the season, they have a lot of food drives and stuff like that. I wanted to tell you, um, food drives are good, okay? But there's a lot of inefficiencies that come along with it. For example, yeah, you can donate a bunch of um, food, right? But all of that food has to be verified and stacked and stocked and somebody's got to carry it somewhere. Gas has got to be spent to send it somewhere. All that different stuff. The best thing that you can do, this might sound so anti-charitable or reverse, reverse psychology, it's not, okay? A monetary donation is more than a drive can do, okay? By giving money to that charity, say uh, it's Missouri Food Drive, something like that, it's actually more profitable and more logical to just give them a monetary donation. Now it sounds, it sounds like, oh, it's, it's just a cop out for not helping out with your charity duties. It's not, I promise. Um, you actually get a lot more out of, oh, you get a lot more out of the uh, monetary donations because, um, there, there's farmers and there's there's deals that are made for um, people where if you're a charity and you're purchasing you can get like a ton of food for really cheap so if, if you're a soup kitchen or if you're a, a food provider or something like that you can actually get a lot more bang for your buck because you're a charity and it's it's very helpful so that, that doesn't mean don't do food drives or don't do charities. Okay, still do them because it's, it, you should. It, I'm just saying, like, it's more efficient to uh, to just give money. And if you can't give money, then the food drives are the way to go. That's that's always good, too. So. Oh, my gosh. I just realized it's 17 minutes. We've gone way too far. Uh, okay, so... Leave me a comment down below. Let me know, should I do something else? Should I keep cleaning up the base? Should I play public servers? Should I shave my beard and not do the, the thing? You tell me what to do in the comments down below. I'm going to go see if I can get some time and, and I might play some Minecraft. So, uh, or something else, you know? I, I do have a challenge from, from Dark J. I got to go do the challenge. Spooky's Mansion. Stay tuned. Love you guys very much. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things. Post call out at the end of the video like a good YouTuber does. <gasps> But it's your choice. If you want to subscribe, go for it. If not, that's cool too. You were here, you watched, you had fun. I love you guys very much. Have a great night, and we'll talk to you very soon. Outro. Want some new merch? Check out teespring.com. Outro.